this series, Sinus 2 Exploring is based in 3,000 years later. At that time, the civilization of human people has made a greater progress in mind as well as in science. Being able to immigrate onto stars, people don't need weapons nor soldiers anymore. Being freed from bothering about material inconveniences, they have been able to concentrate on enriching their mind, getting all of their dreams come true by their intelligence. People have no more desire for precision or wealth. People imagine enough to keep justice without any law or rule. This ultimate world is just like the world in the golden age, which their ancestors imagined in their own homes. At the same time, people started to miss their motherland, the earth, so they built the Serastro Exploring System. Explorers from everywhere in the galaxy travel to the Earth by way of celestial gate network. When they pass through the gate, they can see the Earth, which is as natural as it originally was. It was restored by the human being remained on the Earth. Kagaya started to draw this series in 1997. To now, it's still continuing. This is my favorite series. Kagaya embodied a whole world which is nearly dreamed by everyone. It is too pure, too perfect that we know if it would only appear in people's dreams. But because it's not true, it became a consolation to people who are living in the real world. Maybe this is why people like Kagaya's work so much. They are based on reality, and the hyper-realism brings people into the world. Oh.